This is how to play Sorry Guys, which is a collaborative game for two to six players, ages 10 and up, and each game runs about 15 minutes long. Although the players are working together toward a common goal in this game, they are not allowed to communicate in any way. Sorry Guys includes cards numbered 0 through 100, which will be used to make four piles during gameplay. Two of those piles will count up from 0, indicated by the two going up cards, and the other two piles will count down from 100, indicated by the two going down cards. To start the game, a player is selected at random to go first. Then the numbered cards are shuffled, and each player is dealt six cards. The remaining cards become the replenished pile. Now player one must play at least two of their six cards on any combination of the four piles. For example, if this was player one's hand, they would place the 98 on one of the two going down piles, and they'd place the six on one of the two going up piles. They can choose to play more than just two cards if they'd like, but since they really have no other cards that are close in numbers, they should really just pass. At the end of the player's turn, they replenish their hand back up to six cards, and then the next player starts their turn. If this were the next player's hand, it would be the perfect time for them to say, sorry guys, as they play two cards that do the least amount of damage. Remember, the piles have to continue in the direction they're going, so if a player skips too many numbers on their turn, it will make it more challenging to win the game. When the replenish pile is empty, each player then only has to play one card on their turn instead of two, although they're still allowed to play more if they choose to. If at any point a player has a card that is exactly 10 higher than the top card on either of the going down piles, they can play that card immediately regardless of whose turn it is. And the same goes for cards that are 10 lower than the top card on either of the going up piles. This can be a huge help in the game as it fixes the piles, and it's even better when there are multiple fixes that happen at the same time. But remember, the player doesn't replenish their hand until the end of their own turn. So if they fix a pile during someone else's turn, they'll have fewer than six cards at the start of their own turn, but they're still required to play at least two cards. If a player is able to empty their entire hand by fixing piles on other people's turns, then they're allowed to replenish their hand immediately, regardless of whose turn it is. And if at any point a player is not able to play a card on their turn, the game ends and the players lose. To win the game of Sorry Guys, every card in the deck must be played. And that's how to play Sorry Guys.